Mind now, dummy guys. Second pair. I hate these Novelty socks. Novelty socks at that price can't be packed up. Be thankful you have I'd socks. rather have no socks than be dancing like this. You're not dancing. Black lemon time. I'm a father. There be, there's infernal butterflies. See? And you said the charm came out of the world. Rebellion. I should pretend I never heard the rumours of your involvement. Alohomora. Alohomora. Revelio. Hello. Oh, welcome to Brood and Peck. I'm Ellie Peck. And before you ask, I'm out of a Braxton hair. The lot of it was bought up by a trader in Ottery St. Catchpole. Made me take it in person, they did. No care that I had to shut the shop. Apparently had a bad experience with someone shipping them hair for my wampus cat. Must have been someone from America, no doubt. Because we don't even have a Mia. Anyway, what are you here for? Moon car fur? Derical feathers? Always have trouble collecting them myself as the bird keeps disappearing. Cheeky thing. <laughs> Used to carry them in the shop, Derry calls. But people kept asking for their money back when they'd get home and the blasted things would be nowhere in sight. I can imagine that would be rather frustrating. There's worse. Trust me. Most of the suppliers of Thwopper Feathers may as well be living in St Mungo's. Not surprising, I suppose, the cry in those things. Oh, but such marvellous feathers. <laughs> Almost worth going mad for. Sounds like stocking your shelves comes with some hazards. Truer words never spoken. Used to carry beasts themselves. Good business it was, but add it up to ear with parents grumbling. Not my fault if the little ones caught a flea of an easel. Oh, you should have heard them. No, <laughs> best with byproducts. And I do like to make sure the beasts are safe and well cared for. Couldn't guarantee that with some of these prospective owners. Now, why don't you have a good look around? Stocks change all the time, and not just because they disappear. Always best to pop in whenever you can to get things before they run out. <laughs> Which they used to literally do. <laughs> thank you, I will. Take all the time you need. And thank you for stopping by. A treat to have you here. What do you have for sale? Now, what sorts of beast byproducts might you be looking to acquire? You could never go wrong with those. Good choice, I'd say. I'll not mind seeing you here again. Consider yourself welcome. I'll not mind seeing you here again. Consider yourself welcome. Alohomora.
Revelio. Rebellion. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, greetings. Uh, any luck removing some more of those demiguy statues? I actually have some moons for you. Dear me, you have been busy. Incredible, thank you. You're ready for the final Alahamora lesson. With this knowledge, no lock shall ever stand in your way. You have done all I asked. I only wish I knew who put those statues everywhere in the first place. <sighs> Alas. If you do find more, please feel free to remove them. You'll be doing your caretaker a huge service. And if I ever find out who the bully is behind this cruel trick, I shall let you know. Thank you once again for your assistance and tenacity. Now that you've mastered Alahamora, no lock is unbreakable. Uh, but do feel free to keep finding Demigai's statues and removing those moons. <laughs> Look at me! Rebellion. Alohomora. What do we have here? A demigod. Mine now, demigods. Alohomora. Knowing a meat, he's likely studied her.
you are the one who has been interfering with a rather personal matter. The Demigai's statues and the moons contained therein were placed as they were for good reason. You should not meddle in the personal affairs of others. I don't think Mr. Pemberton meant to use his own stationery. He knows something about those Demigai's moons. He's in Hogsmeade, apparently. Perhaps I shall pay him a visit. Hello, Hamora. Mine now, Demi guys. Hamora. this time, Merlin.
Revelio. Good bring up. Revelio. Rebellion. Incendio, Akio. 
to share in my victory. Revelio. Who lived here, I wonder? Good friend. What do you have in store for me this time? Incendio! Sandy. 
Revelio. Here's one of those tables Professor Shaw mentioned. I know what that means. Ah! 
an intruder! Mysterious and a bit unsettling. What to do? Nothing over here. Enjoy suffering, do you?
rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. Not your best moments, I fear. <laughs> Incendio. Surprise. Confringo. Rebellion. Confringo. 